Hi, my name's Jeff Kosmoski with Cosm Guitars. Thanks for clicking on my video link. Today I want to talk about uh, another one of my new guitars. This is the uh, AW6. Um, from a general perspective, it shares a lot in common with a uh, Fender Stratocaster. It's got uh, three single coil pickups and a uh, five-way selector switch. Um, but at that point, the similarity ends pretty quickly, um, as you can tell. Uh, from the body style. Um, one of my main uh, design philosophies is to get away from the flat guitars of the 1950s and see if we can't introduce some more modern uh, styling features into the, uh, the overall body. Uh, the main advantages of getting away from a flat guitar geometry and going to something with some curvature, um, other than the fact that it just, I think it looks much more visually appealing and visually exciting, is the fact that it, um, from, a, from a playing perspective, it just wants to uh, conform to your body much more readily than a, a flat guitar does. It's got a real nice ergonomic feel to it, and it hugs up real close and intimately with your body. Um, and uh, so, so that, that's, that's kind of a, a, a drastic uh, difference right there. And what this does, though, is, what's interesting is that um, because the, the body is curved, it allows your forearm and your wrist to kind of lay much more naturally into the uh, the, the guitar body, um, which at the face of it doesn't seem that important, but I think what it does is that it allows you to play it much more naturally. Um, in a flat guitar, your arm would be forced away from the, the, the bridge area, and as a consequence, to play it um, with, with a, a sense of ergonomic ease, you'd be forced to bring the guitar back to get your your right elbow back closer to your body where it wants to be. The downside though is that when you do that, it wants to bring the left side of the guitar out. And so now your left arm is standing out away from you. And you end up kind of fighting that as you're, as you're playing the guitar, looking for that sweet spot where you know, either arm is seeing kind of the most, or the, the same amount of, uh, of stress. So with, with this um, curved style of guitar though, what's nice is that it brings your right arm and elbow back closer to your body, which is a much more natural position, and there's no need now to bring the left side far far out from your body, so it presents itself as a much more, um, I believe, a much more ergonomically and easy uh, playing guitar design. The, uh, the main difference in my, uh, my guitars is the, uh, the ergonomics and the, the curvature. Um, beyond that, uh, perhaps the second uh, most exciting thing is I'm, I've gotten away entirely from the um, old classic style of knobs. These uh, these knobs, there's a, a tone and volume knob, are made from a uh, rapid prototyping process called uh, stereo stereo lithography SLS. And what this does is, the first thing it does is it lets you get to make uh, make these knobs any design that you want. You're no longer locked into the conventional you know 50s 60s ish kind of knobs that are so prevalent on many guitars, you have total design freedom to make them. So these, I don't, I don't know if you can see it or not, they've got a little design element on there, but they're actually made from a uh, kind of an elastomeric uh, outer piece that's uh, very ergonomic, and then there's a hard uh, nylon inner uh, structure that allows it to uh, fasten on to the uh, potentiometers. Um, so beyond that, um, this guitar is uh, very light, and the main reason is because it's actually chambered. There's a chamber in this area, another separate chamber here, a, cham a small chamber up in this pocket here, and of course a, a chamber down here for the, uh, the electronics. You can find uh, more details and, and uh, information on my website about this particular guitar, the AW6, but in addition it's got a uh, Goto uh, hardtail bridge with uh, string through ferrules on the back. Um, it's got DiMarzio uh, true velvet pickups and um, a Schaller five way selector switch. People often ask me what my guitars are made of if they're actually made of wood, and as you can see by this one, indeed they are. Uh, this is a different body, of course, um, but they're very similar. Now uh, they both have maple. Uh, in the interior spine area, and that's uh, I think that's fairly important because that's the area to which the bridge mounts as well as the neck, and the maple gives it nice strength and um, kind of acoustic sustain. Um, the outer areas are made of a different type of wood. This particular one happens to be ash. The uh, blue guitar I'm using alder. So let's take a listen to how this guitar sounds. I'm I'm playing through a, a small Fender Vibrochamp XD 
and I'm going to start on a clean uh, setting uh, for a uh, clean vintage uh, based on an early blackface. So let's start with the treble position. Second position. Third position. And again, I'm using the uh, treble pickup and the uh, neck pickup. Position four, just these two pickups. And the fifth position, just the, uh, the neck, position, uh, neck pickup. Back to the uh, bridge position. Position two. And I think in this position you can hear that distinctive uh, Fender-esque sound that you get when you mix uh, two uh, single coil pickups together. Okay, that was the clean uh, position condition. Here I'm going to add some uh, distortion. Now I've switched over to uh, position 7 on the uh, uh, VibroChamp XD. In the uh, bridge position. Position two. Middle position. Position four. Position five. Okay, so there you go. A real quick walkthrough on the AW6 by Cosm Guitars. Uh, if you have any questions, please check out my website. There's uh, much more detailed information and photographs um, on the guitar as well as my other guitars. And if you have any questions, by all means, uh, drop me an email at uh, jeff at cosmguitars.com. Thanks a lot for watching.